Why should we do that? Because the salts have herbicidal activity. So how many kinds of uh, different glyphosate salts in total? So uh, what are the differences uh, and the features of these different kinds of uh, glyphosate salts? I never heard about this before. Uh, what about the efficacy? Do you know the cost of the, the cost difference between these uh, different products? For glyphosate, we've already talked about two topics. One is about the different percentages of glyphosate SL. Another one is about the surfactants used in glyphosate products. We really appreciate your subscription and feedback. Uh, today, we are going to talk about the different salts in glyphosate formulations. It's a question from one of our customers. Uh, I hope you can find the answer from our discussions today. Okay, so let's welcome Ria back to the showroom. Hello, Ria. Hello, Harry. Hello, everyone. I'm Ria. Ria, as I know, the technical grade of glyphosate is a kind of acid, but the glyphosate formulations become different kinds of salts, like uh, ammonium salt, IPA salt, and potassium salt. Why should we do that? The technical grade of glyphosate is a kind of weak acid. Its solubility in water is only 12 gram per liter at room temperature and also very low solubility in organic solids. Solubility is very important for pesticide formulation products, but we can see that glyphosate acid is not suitable to produce herbicide products directly. Especially the product need to be diluted with water when the farmers use it. On the other hand, glyphosate salts are very soluble in water. They increase the stability of the products and the salt portion of the formulation may allow greater absorption and penetration of glyphosate into the leaves. Okay, so does the salt have herbicidal activity? No, the salt itself does not have herbicidal activity. Mm -hmm. Only the glyphosate acid acts at the target sites within the plants. Mm -hmm. Okay, so how many kinds of uh, different glyphosate salt in total? And uh, what is the difference between the glyphosate salts? In the production of glyphosate, the most common glyphosate salts is potassium salt, IPA salt, and ammonium salts. Yes. As I know, also have other salts like uh, chimeso salts and mm -hmm. sodium salts, mm -hmm. but they are not uh, very commonly used now. Okay. Let's take a look at this picture. This is the molecular formula of glyphosate acid. As we just see, it's a kind of weak acid. It has low solubility in water or organic solids. So it's not suitable for directly use as a herbicide. Mm -hmm. But its acid area can combine with different kinds of patients to form different kinds of glyphosate salts. For example, when it combines with potassium ion, it becomes two glyphosate potassium salts. When it combines with IPA, it becomes two glyphosate IPA salt. If it combines with ammonium, it becomes two glyphosate ammonium salts. If it combines with sodium ion, it becomes two glyphosate sodium salts. Okay, so uh, what are the differences uh, and the features? of these different kinds of uh, glyphosate salts? Glyphosate potassium salts quickly action and better rain resistance than other salts. Mm -hmm. And the potassium is a kind of nutrient element. Uh, yes. It also can benefit to the soil and the crops. Yes. It's usually made into glyphosate SL and SG formulation. Mm -hmm. Glyphosate IPA salt it has the cost-effective and the better low temperature resistance. Yes, yes. It's the most common used in the glyphosate products. Yes, it's also the most commonly exported product by ourselves. Yes, it's usually made into the SL formulation. Yes. Glyphosate ammonia salt, it has a simple production process mm -hmm. with lower price, low materials. Yes, cheap. Mm -hmm. It's usually 
uh, made into the SL, ST, and SG formulation for glyphosate sodium salt. I've never heard about this before. <laughs> yes, we don't use the uh, sodium salt as a herbicide. Mm -hmm. It can act as a plant growth regulator mm -hmm. and uh, accelerate the ripening of specific crops. Uh, so, uh, what about the efficacy? Is there any test results showing the efficacy of uh, these different kinds of uh, glyphosate salt? Yes, based on the field trial test in China, in the same condition, mm. the efficacy of the different glyphosate products is potassium salt better than aqueous salt, mm. better than ammonium salt, and better sodium salt. Of course, this resource is just for reference yeah, because yeah. the efficacy is affected by many factors. Yeah, soil conditions, resistance, and many other factors. Yeah. Yes, yes. So in different areas, the resource may be different. Yeah. So uh, what about the price? Do you know the cost of uh, the cost difference between these the different products? If comparing the prices in the same percentage level, mm -hmm. the price usually is potassium salt uh, higher than IPA salt, higher than ammonium salt, and higher than sodium salt. Mm -hmm. And it's depending on the prices of different raw materials. Yes, the raw material difference, the price trend will be different too. Yes, of course. Okay, thank you so much, Ria. Uh, everyone, after the above comparison, hope you have more clear understanding about glyphosate-based products with different salts. Uh, this is all for today. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel. If you have any more questions regarding to the glyphosate products, please leave us a message down here below in the comment zone and King Wenzhong will try to provide you with more information regarding to the pesticide industry. King Kunsa, focus on your heart.